Next, on This Week in Agribusiness, it's Max's Tractor Shed, spotlighting another great American tractor. And Max's Tractor Shed this weekend, kicking off this centennial year for the Farmall brand. I suppose it wouldn't surprise you to hear that there is a red Farmall tractor. There'll be others during the year, but this week it's a Farmall. Max's Tractor Shed is being brought to you by Mystic Lubricants. We welcome those folks to the This Week in Agribusiness family. With Mystic Lubricants, you can keep your machines working harder for longer, season after season. Mystic Lubricants made to make it last. Well, we heard from many of you, you enjoyed our Farm All 100 special broadcast last weekend. Thank you for communicating with us about that. We enjoyed telling the story. And we thought, yes, indeed, we'd show you a Farm All this weekend kicking off the year. This one is right where it has been since it was delivered new to Jake Lauber's granddad in New Jersey. Jake Lauber is farming there a little bit east of eastern Pennsylvania, just a little bit east of the Delaware River, maybe an hour and a half out of New York City, and has this Super M that his grandfather bought new. Look at that restoration. Why, that's a blue ribbon restoration. You can see the ribbon hanging on the grill there from the local county fair. Now, I don't know if you can see this or not, but back over the belt pulley, back there behind the Super M, I saw green. And Jake confided in me, yes, he restores green tractors too, along with the red ones there. Oh, you need to see this. Look at those front tires. Those are original. Those are the ones that came on that Super M when it was delivered brand new, a 1952 Farmall Super M. It's right there at Bloomsbury, New Jersey.